Actually, some of, if any of my England family watch this, they're going to be like, oh, he never told us. <laughs> hey guys, my name's Thomas. If you didn't already know, and if you did already know, welcome back. Uh, today's video is a Q&A again. I didn't really have many hair ideas in mind this week, so I just went, why not? Let's do another Q&A. But I have a visitor with me this week. It's John! <laughs> it's been in a lot of videos lately, actually. Uh, we've got the three cameras set up, so you can kind of see everything that's going on right now. And what Josh is going to be doing is reading out the questions that I picked out this week. Uh, I was a bit disappointed. Again, there was only four Twitter questions that I could really pull from Twitter, uh, which, you know, that's all right. That's, at least people did it. Um, but I thought, oh, well, we can go and get more questions from my YouTube channel because they come in every day. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. All right, let's get into it. Joshy, what do you got for me? So Jacob Powell asked... Who did you first come out to? God. Um, I actually... You know what, I don't even remember. I think uh, my coming out was kind of like a really gradual thing, and uh, yeah, I don't really have an answer. <laughs> How did you come out? To my parents, or to my, my friends, or what? Everything. I sort of, uh, I sort of <laughs> networked it out to like my friends that I had at the time, and then eventually just told pe members of the family as they needed to know. Oh. Actually, some of, if any of my England family watch this, they're going to be like, oh, he never told us. <laughs> Alright, next question. Um, the next question comes from Nikolai. Have you considered or thought about growing out your undercut? I love your videos and your Instagram. Oh, okay. Like well, the I... seedy face and love heart. I don't like the seedy face. I like the love heart. The seedy face on that's questionable. Aww. <laughs> <Nikolai, laughs> you're, you're in trouble, Nikolai. Um, Nikolai, thank you so much for watching my videos. Uh, when you say grow out my undercut, do you mean like grow this out to like the other length? Because if that's what you meant, absolutely no, girl. Like, no, I would not do that. <laughs> I would not grow this undercut out. I am so in love with this hairstyle. Uh, I've had it for nearly two years now and I'm still not over it, which is really weird for me because I really do like to change things up. So, uh, yeah, I would I would not consider growing my undercut out. But thank you so much for watching me. I really appreciate it. Okay. Nicholas Thomas asks, how do you quickly grow out an undercut? Oh my god, who fucking knows? Actually, uh, Nicholas Thomas, uh, thank you for this question. I'm researching at the moment a couple of things to make your hair grow faster. Uh, I've just obviously got to trial it out. Obviously, you can't use something once and just know what it is. I've got to spend a lot of time researching uh, if, if this method that I'm researching actually works. So if it does, I will be letting all of you know and I'll be doing a video uh, a video about it. Okay? Thanks. This is the, Now we're going on to the YouTube questions. Okay. YouTube questions. And you fucked up real bad last week. Oh In no. your video. Yeah, this helmet. No. Dean Humphreys commented, you do know that you're supposed to tone and then moisturize. Yes. The other way around. We know that. Josh, Josh said that he knew that while I was saying it, but I always thought that you just moisturize and then tone, and then my mum and my sister were like, what? And then a lot of you guys were kind of like, Tom, that's the wrong thing to do. And I'm like, fuck, I'm not a skin professional. Shit. Not a Shit. True not a true gay. <laughs> Fuck off. Yes, I am. I could show you true K. Um, yeah, no, I, uh, I, Dean Humphreys, is that his name? Yeah. I like him. He leaves me loves, lovely comments all the time. Dean Humphreys, I do certainly know, <laughs> I do certainly know that now, and I will never, ever, ever moisturize before I tone in the future. So, thanks for that. And thank you to everyone else who told me. Except Josh, <laughs> when I was making the video. Gary Green asks, how do you get so much volume with your hair being so long? Tell you what, Gary, I have enough hair to um, probably fit 500 people. I don't have to do much to my hair at all. Even when it's straightened, it's not thin. There's just volume all the time. It's thick, it's crazy, and that's just how it happens. Where if you have really thin hair, you'll have to look into um, methods on how to get more volume in it. For me, I don't really look into that kind of stuff because I don't need it. So I'm sorry I can't really be of aid there. Okay, monkey shine forty four. Okay, monkey Thomas, shine. how did you quit smoking? Question mark. Oh, not easy. Actually, no. This time around was easy. <coughs> it was probably about the seventh time I've quit. I started smoking when I was thirteen years old, which is super duper young. But there, I always had these friends that would say there comes a time where you just don't need it anymore. And I, I constantly sat there thinking, oh my god. I don't think that's ever going to happen to me, um, until it did. And then you literally, when you make that decision that you don't need that thing anymore, boom, it's easy. Um, but if you, if you definitely don't have that feeling, if you have that feeling of, oh, I need to quit, but you, you still deep down don't want to, I wouldn't even try because you're just going against your own feelings, really. The end. <laughs> Namaste. Namaste. And the last Namaste question here. is, 
a video, like not a video, is a question about the bum hair removal video. Oh yeah, my favourite. I should, you know what, I should do a single Q&A just about that because there are so many questions on that fucking video. I'll answer it because I'm the one that gave him the idea of that, like, a smooth Yeah, bum. actually, do you guys remember when I spoke about uh, a boy having a really pretty bum in my butt hair removal video? That was Josh. I do try, I do oh. try. That was before we were even a thing though, it was just kind of like a, oh. So I technically should be doing this video because I know a lot more about it than Tom does. Oh, okay. Well, hit it, Josh. <laughs> What's the question? <laughs> Lily Cho asks, does it burn? I read reviews and says it does. Mm, okay. Hey, Lily. Um, personally, uh, for me, no. There was no burn at all. Zero, zero, zero burn. What about you, Josh? My ass was like... Didn't hurt at all. Cool. Well, I, I thought as well that it would burn and uh, be a little bit more hostile than it was. Uh, I have tried Nair before and it was years and years and years ago when they only brought it out for women. And it, it burnt back then, but I was really surprised when I tried this, uh, the NADS product mm. and there was no burn whatsoever. You and you get the sensitive stuff with aloe vera as well, because aloe vera... Is that the one that we got though? I'm pretty sure we got the Nair sensitive. Yeah. No, it's NADS. NADS sure. sensitive. Well, like all it just over, says that's for men, doesn't it? Yeah, but if it means like all over body, then you're safe. Yeah, because they've obviously done it everywhere. So if you put it anywhere, it's not gonna hurt like something. Burn. Well, yeah, and every, but though, don't quote us on that because everybody has a different skin type. Everybody has a different reaction to everything, and that really needs to be taken into account before you put something that might burn you on your body. Do a test patch. I can't tell you what's gonna happen to your skin. Um, all I can tell you is my experience with that product was absolutely fantastic. Same with Josh. Yeah! And was that my last question, was it? Yeah. Alright guys, well, that's all we've got time for this week. If you do want any questions answered, uh, please head over to Twitter, ask your question with the hashtag AskThomasInAction, and I will get back to you. Um, thank you so much for coming back to watch again. Thank you, Josh, for joining me yet again on another video. We're gonna have to... Do you guys think we should just make a channel? What, what do we need to do? What do we need to do? You tell us. <laughs> you look worried about that. <laughs> Um, anyway, so thank you so much for coming back. Love you lots, and I will see you next week for another video. Bye! Until the other day, I met a boy who actually had a very pretty bum. I'm not going to say his name because he probably wouldn't appreciate that. Um, but I said, how do you get your bum like that? And he was kind of like, well, I just use this stuff. And I went,